Hello everybody! In this tutorial, you'll learn how to use Arduino in MadMapper using the Fermata module. First, you need to download the Arduino software on the official website. Click the software menu. Then, in the download options, select your operating system. Wait for the download to finish. Once finished, double-click to launch the installer. Follow the steps to finish installing Arduino. Once done, launch the IDE. In the top left menu, click File, Examples, Fermata and Standard Fermata to load the Fermata library. Then go to Tools and make sure the Arduino Uno board is selected. Connect your Arduino and check if the connected port is selected. After this, Click the Upload button. At the bottom left, you should see the Uploading status. You will be notified once Fermata is uploaded to your Arduino board. The next step is to make an LED blink with MadMapper. Connect a wire to the third digital pin and to the positive pole in, of your breadboard. Link a resistance to this wire it will limit the intensity of the electric current in order to protect your LED. Add the LED, take care to the direction of the pins. Link the positive to the negative pole. Finally, close the circuit by adding a wire to the ground and the negative pole. Now in MadMapper, go to the module tab and search for the Fermata module. Select the port of your connected board and select the correct model, here the Arduino Uno. Go down to pin 3, change the mode to PWM and increase the intensity of the LED, LED by moving the slider. Right, are you still with me? Man Mapper can also react to sensors. Here you can see an example with a light sensor. Connect the signal wire to an analog pin, here pin A0. The red wire goes to the positive pole and the green one to the negative. Link the positive pole to 5 volts pin and the negative pole to the ground pin. In MadMapper at the bottom you should see the analog pins reacting when covering the light sensor. We can also link an LED to the sensor. Add a wire to the third digital pin. Attach a resistance to this wire like before. Connect the LED and attach it to the negative pole. In MadMapper, check if the LED is working. Right click and add control to it. Select MadMapper and then Fermata. Select the pin attached to the light sensor, here A0. Then remap the ranges in order to switch off the LED when covering the light sensor. Finally, MadMapper also supports servo motors. Connect the positive and negative poles like previously. Attach the servo motor to pin 3 and to 2 poles. In MadMapper, you can change the mode to servo and change the value to make the servo motor rotating. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy!